Avocados, avocados are one of my favorite, favorite fruits. We call them fruits, yes. Favorite, favorite fruit. Lots of people don't know it's a fruit because it's a natural fat. It's a medium chain fat. What that means is that your body recognizes the fat in avocado and will immediately and very efficiently change it to energy. So that fat is never stored on your body. It's never stored on your body. And there's many different varieties of avocados. This is Laura's stand here. And um, I'm going to let her talk to us a little bit about the different varieties because a lot of times you just think that there's just one, right? But they do have different flavors and different tastes and different textures. They do. This one is the late season variety. It's really creamy. You cut, it stays green when it ripens. And when you cut it, it doesn't oxidize or get dark. You can scoop it right out of the shell. It does really great. Very creamy. Very, very creamy. So that's that's reed. Did you hear what she said? So reed is the very creamy variety. It's when it... It's custardy texture. texture, and it also, when it's ripe, it stays green. So it's really about touching it, correct? Well, Touch not too much touching, but, you but know. yeah, you don't want to. Yeah, don't don't, it. don't, don't no, squeeze no, the avocados. No, don't squeeze. No, so then next to them we have Haas. Haas is the standard variety, and it's really thick texture. It's a little more about oil, a little more oil content. And so this one's good. It slices. It keeps its shape when you slice it. It's very good. So this is better on salads, would you say, because of the oil content and the, the, yeah. it keeps its texture? Yeah, it keeps its shape. And so if you want some thick guacamole, this is great. These two are great together because it's creamy and good. Mm -hmm. And then I have this one down here, which is the Mexicola. And the Mexicola is a variety where you can actually eat the peel. Wow. Oh, it's like a it looks like an eggplant, but that's actually a... Avocado. And look at how nice and soft that is. Yeah, it looks like a plum almost. It looks like, a plum. like an awkward plum. So you can eat. You can eat the peel. You can eat the peel. Yeah, it's great. I think we're gonna have to get a couple of each. So today, what we're gonna do, because I'm a raw food chef, we're gonna do avocados in our dessert. So we're gonna make a raw cacao pudding, and we're gonna use the creamy texture. So I'm thinking that we should get a couple reeds. Haas, I use a lot, and that's the one that you see at most grocery stores, most farmers market. It's the most popular one. Um, I use it a lot when I do avocados in salads, so one of my favorites would be like a grapefruit, lots of citrus right now as well, like a grapefruit avocado, and then you can pick your green. Um, a lot of time I like frizzy or I like arugula. I'm a big wild arugula person because I'm kind of spicy myself. And then you can just toss that up with um, grapefruit juice and a little olive oil, a little lemon, and a lot of cracked pepper, and there you've got a beautiful salad, beautiful salad.